Uh, we are going to continue our adventure in the ever so creepy home sweet home um, with poor uh, alcoholic Tim. And uh, for those of you who've watched my other videos, you know in the last episode I couldn't figure out why I couldn't pick up some stuff off the floor. Um, Mr. Editor, when he was ed editing that particular uh, episode, uh, looked at me and said, why don't you just crouch? And which time I realized, you know what? I just needed to crouch. And all of a sudden, my mouse doesn't work. Why does my, come on, there we go. Oh my lord. So, yes. Uh, here's the uh, piece of mysterious photograph. It is a piece of mysterious photograph. Well, oh, that was fucking enlightening. Why do I keep doing that shit? Oh, I know why. Because I'm having to. I do that to pause. I mean, to, whatever. So, how about we? Now we are stuck. We just still haven't gotten out of that. That's why. Well, you quit already. Good God. No. So, apparently I'm having all kinds of, um, been playing a lot of Destiny lately, guys, and the controls work different things. Okay, so, even though it started me back in the little crawl space, I still accomplished whatever else I accomplished here. Okay, cool. Do, 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 do. So we will come up here and we will again crouch and this time we will pick up this freaking note. Jane's diary. There is something I want to share. Today is simply one of the happiest days of my life so far. Why? Because we finally had our own house. It's Tim's to be exact. He worked so hard and saved up for this house. Tim also said that the house was our first anniversary gift since we married. Isn't that s the sweetest thing ever? Thank you a million times, Tim. I love you more than anything. I see. So, she loves Tim more than anything. And so, I guess, since I'm figuring the dead chick that uh, was fooling around with all the um, uh, black magic witchy poo stuff, it's probably Jane for whatever reason. Um, I, I figure Jane is dead, so maybe maybe Tim has picked up the whole I'm a big giant alcoholic slob thing since her unfortunate death. Why I have to keep picking that picture up? I don't know. So, um, and, and, and realizing that I was a dumbass about the crouching, I decided to try to do the key again. Only looking at this level. Ah! Oh my god, sometimes I could possibly be smart. Yeah, I'm playing this during the day this time. Uh, partially because... I wondered if maybe playing it so late at night before was part of why I was a big derp. But probably not. It was probably just a matter of I'm a big derp. I don't call it derp gaming for nothing. Alright. We can now get into Jane's room. Yay. Wow. Oh, Tim. What are you doing here? What are you doing up so late? Oh, I'm... I'm, I'm just writing. Oh, yeah? Can I take a look? No, it's private. Get out of here. Okay. Well, it's time for bed. Let's see. Is that Jane's diary? More of Jane's diary. We sound surprised. We've been finding pages of it all along. I feel like I was getting worse. I keep seeing things that aren't there. It kept happening, and one time I thought from the house. Someone I felt, sometimes I feel like I'm being watched from somewhere. It felt creepy around the stair cupboard as well. 
Jeez, you're not doing any better, Jane. Take great care of yourself for Tim. Did he just did I just talk to my talk to myself in my diary? Haha, <laughs> weird me. Maybe she's the one the curse was put on. Maybe somebody else wanted Tim. Because they all seem to be charms to like get even with somebody or uh, make somebody love you. Tim hasn't come home yet. We don't hang out anymore, not to mention going out together. We should pray a little and make some good karma. Who knows? Things might get better. And I did that again. Because I suck. Okay. Get out of that. Right. Before I dress that thing up there, I'm going to check out this room a little since... I had to dirt my way into it. Let's see here. Nothing. That's not a door I can open. Should I crouch? Make sure there's nothing at crouch level on this side. God, I feel like such an artard about that. Then why don't you just crouch? Because I'm stupid, that's why. Because I wouldn't do anything as obvious as just crouching. Feeling Jane like napped in here a lot or slept here. All right. Oh, more of her goofy diary. Let's see what she got here. I've been feeling so forgetful recently. I thought that the phone was in the kitchen. I was looking everywhere, but then I found it in the bedroom. I kn knew that I remembered, or maybe that was just me. Come on, Jane. Maybe I was a little stressed out, huh? Get yourself together, Jane. One more thing. I kind of knew that I haven't been fully rested lately. That was what I thought. I thought that was what I thought, though. I saw. I thought I saw something strange around the house. The television was broken, maybe. The signal was hardly there. There was one time that things got me so freaked out, though, because I was sure I heard a funeral prayer through the static sound. That totally gave me the chills. Oh! So that's what that, that, that tonal thing is. It's, it's a prayer. Let's see. Let's see. So. Let's see. String everywhere? Oh no. Jane? Oh god. This is bad. But yay! We moved on from the damn house. Ugh. Game should understand. You want me to be running and shooting, or just running away, or holy crap. Oh, this is creepy. There's more of that string. Of course, part of my question would be, I guess, why, why does my storage closet keep turning into the netherworld? Jane? <laughs> You? The sound's not coming far from here. Oh, that's real helpful. That, I don't know. I was gonna say, it seems like a dead end, but it looks like it turns a little here. Oh, yeah. Horrifying. Oh, look, it's the string. Oh look, it's a clue that I can get because I'm crouching. A picture of a knife. Oh, well that's going to be helpful. A picture of a unusual looking knife. I don't know, I don't think it looks that unusual. So, we've done some more macrame up this shaft here. Just put the string. <gasps> what the fuck was that?
Yes. This is never good. I should be playing Destiny 2. <laughs> Wheezing to death in this horrid black mold infested nastiness. My immune system is probably shocked since I'm a freaking alcoholic. And who knows? Maybe I'm not even seeing any of this. Maybe I've just got the DTs or something. It's all a hallucination. Uh, we're going back to that creepy ass dormitory or whatever the hell it was. Am I the only one that questions the fact there's just big giant holes in walls? Yeah, we're back here because I recognize that picture. Nope, yep, more red string. This is bad. So bad. So many horrible things are going to happen to me in March. I know it, I know it. Oh, this looks different. Okay. Perhaps we have magically... Apparently we've magically teleported somewhere else. No. Jane's Diary! This... That was not better. I was sure I fell into a deep sleep. Then why in the world was I in an old wooden house? And what was with that shadow creeping outside. I've never seen anything that gigantic before. I was unable to get myself out of that nightmare. Back to my bedroom. What is happening to me? I don't know if I have a feeling it's going to happen to me in a minute. Okay, it's definitely an old wooden house. Oh, light switch. Oh! Dirty plates. Is that wolves? Oh. Yeah, apparently we've got wolves. Oh, not a clue. We have to run from wolves because that is apparently a thing here. That was the door I came in, I think. I can't open this door. No, I can't open this door. No, I can't. It is locked. Let me guess. My goal is to find a key and go. Oh shit. Door. Oh no, that's not good. There's blood on the monsters in that. Wow, none of these people look happy. Oh, thank God. It's another room and not the cold, dead outside. Group photograph. A photograph of a group of teenagers. Helpful. <laughs> Apparently they had electricity here at one time, I don't know what they do now. All of these lovely d things built in like um, cupboards and stuff, they didn't even utilize them for anything. They're just here to look cool. Alright, well I looked around in there. Does it mean maybe I can open this other door? Nope. That one doesn't open. I have not found any kind of key. But now I figure I must have to find a key to get the hell out of here. So just open the other door. 
Find James, you might be here. Screw Jane. Let's see if any of these actually have. No. I see numbers here. Because that would make sense and make it easy. Ooh. Wait. Let's try the most recent one. Maybe that's this. Uh, okay, that means nothing to me. However, Still means something to me. Hmm. Never knowing I can do that with these. I guess I better check the backs of all of them. Zoom. Go with preferably in a language I actually understand. Oh, my sad face. Hmm. Not exactly drawing it, please. Now I get the whole thing why it was talking about fronts and backs. Whatever those are outside, they sound angry. Very angry. I probably wanted to stay where I'm at. But I can't. Because God knows we need to save Jane. Because otherwise, I will die a lonely, hopeless alcoholic. Wasn't it at all. Um, electrical items and things like that. Keys. Yeah, and I know. Earlier in the video, I called it a rolled meat bracelet. I don't know what the hell I was saying. Magic letters. That does nothing for me either. Begin to try and figure out the code for that. Oh, by the way, turn your damn light back on. Oh. I see. It's conveying the color of the Conveying the combination is what's conveying. I'm not that big of a nerd, so let's figure out what we're looking at here. Uh, first number is white, so it's one, two, three, four, five, six. It's six white ones. Looks like six. We go with six. And then the pink ones. One, two, three, four. 
And blue ones, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So let's go see if our combination is 649, as it is the only clue thus far that makes sense. Now we find out if I can count. Ah! Ah! Well, look, I didn't go straight derp for the first time. So many ba bunch of empty plastic bags, jeez. begin to think everybody in this game is kind of a pig. Did I not scan back up? No, I didn't. That's right. I don't jump. Don't jump in this game. I should have just stay crouched. Do, do, do. Just stay crouched in the cross space. Unless we hear spooky music, it tells us. Yeah, Alright, we're going to be running. Don't know where, but we're going to be running. are going to come right through that gate, aren't they? They're just going to knock down that flimsy bamboo wall and eat me. What the hell? Um. Yeah, those are straight zombies. What the hell? They scurried away! Oh god. We're gonna get eaten by wolves or zombies. I'm not even worried about Jane anymore. Screw Jane. There's way creepier shit running around here. For oh! There's a big hole right in there. I thought this was a giant spider at first. I was like, oh no, spider on my face. There are these angry people again. Oh look, it's our friend the rope. I'm oh, sorry, it's not really a rope, it's a string. The Yazatun Police Radio Station reports that the chief policeman has planned to arrest all the speeding bikers on Yazatun State Highway. The police claim to have captured more than 10 bikers so far, but some fled the scene which includes Mr. Pichai Manapebu, a suspect from the motorcycle robbery, and believed to be the leader of this gang. We'll keep you posted where we receive further notices on this. This is Sisu Fungsuat reporting. I see. basically walk from one end to the other? The Yazatun Police Radio Station reports that the Chief Policeman has planned to arrest all the speeding bikers on Yazatun State Highway. The police claim to have captured more than 10 bikers so far, but some fled the scene, which includes Mr. Pichai Manapebu, a suspect from the motorcycle robbery, and believed to be the leader of this gang. We'll keep you posted when we receive further notices on this. This is Sisu Fungsuat reporting. Was that a bag 
Okay. That was a wall. There's gonna be some point where all these unhappy looking people are gonna turn into like skulls or something. Ah. There might be something that once again requires. I don't know. I'm pretty sure those are like for good luck or something. Oh, it's Sam on either side. Okay. Okay, can't open that yet. So I guess I must have to go We better not find any stinker zombie faces. <gasps> There's a zombie. It's a zombie. There's two of them. What the hell? Hi. What are you guys? Oh, there's three of them. Oh, those must be like spirits that they're feeding. Must maybe trying to placate them. I don't know. They're so weird. Oh my god. Anyway, let's read the newspaper since they don't seem to give a shit about me. The newspaper I can't do at the crouch. Or put on my flashlight, maybe. Nope. So I gotta crouch. Gotta crouch. Gotta crouch. Battle Thieves. Old one robbed and beaten. Neighbors reported a fight the night before. March 8th, it was reported to the police that Miss Chinda meant, come on now, 60, was badly wounded and found unconscious. She was taken to the hospital for, before the police arrived on the scene. Investigators revealed that there may have been more than three people that inflicted such a brutal beating. Her son is believed to be one, the one leading the robbery. Oh, well, he's a dick. Is that what you guys are? Are you like... What you guys got down there? Hmm? Maybe some tasty buffalo wings? I don't know. The souls of unborn, of unbaptized children? Who knows? Alrighty. We open that. Yeah, we can. Well, let's see what else we have going on in here. We could do. Uh -huh. Jesus! What the fuck is that? Holy crap! I just went out to pick up the pictures. Holy shit! I do not even mean that ironically. I'm. I think I just took a year or two off my life. Well, those little boogers are gone now. Let's see what's in this room. Bad writing, I'm sure. Ouch. I will return. I'll get what belongs to me. Why do I get the feeling that it's Grandma that's pissed off in this one? Jane, what the hell did you get yourself into, woman? Ugh. Do I have any desire to look out that window? No, I do not. Bicycle gang up. Oh. More booze. A bunch of bicycle tires. Things and stuff. That's another thing. A lot of times, like I said, I've gotten into watching a lot of the, uh, you know, I would call it Asian gore horror. 
Okay, well that's spooky as shit. No cutscene to some large lumbering beast. Can I close that door? Nope, I can only open it. Oh well, shit. <laughs> but um. Okay, this game has stopped playing around now. I mean, Jane was a pain in the ass. But now I've got scurrying little angry demon zombie ghost things. Apparently I ripped that door right off the wall without realizing it, and then the room changed. And somewhere out there is some giant killer hand. That I'm sure... Oh, look, more red string. That I'm sure is connected to something horrifying that I don't want to know. Oh dear lord. Damn, you stupid drunk. It's the string! The string is bringing all this evilness. It's not like a trap, is it? Let's find out. Oh good, solid wall. Probably doesn't mean anything. But 